the truth is the Dodgers had this division one back in April. There's no chance in hell the San Diego Padres have any chance to ever catch up to them. It's not about making, it's all about just making it to October at this point and hopefully getting a few more home field advantage games. What they really need to do is make sure that they're better than the Atlanta Braves going forward. And yes, like you mentioned, the San Diego Padres hitting a little bit of a rough patch, but as much as it's sexy that they got their hands on Josh Bell, Josh Hader, and Juan Soto, let's not sit here and pretend that they're at full strength. They are about to get Fernando Tatis Jr. back and this lineup is going to go from incredible to off the charts when they get Fernando Tatis Jr. back because then you got to deal with Josh Bell, J- uh, Soto, uh, <laughs> Jake Cronenworth, Will Myers, and a healthy uh, Fernando Tatis Jr. This is one hell of a lineup and it's going to take them into October. As for the actual AL NL West, it's the Dodgers. The Dodgers are not only the best team in the NL West, the best team in baseball. And quite frankly, I don't think it's even close at this point.